First thing first, please be aware that we at Dr. Fee are no financial advisor. This video is for entertainment purpose only. Here is a quick walkthrough how you create your own API key and API secret at Crypto.com in less than two minutes. First, we log into our Crypto.com account. Here we use the desktop version. As a second step, we click on the user center icon and select profile. When being in the profile page, we look for the API keys field in the upper navigation bar. Clicking on API keys will bring us to this page here. If you haven't created an API key beforehand, this page is empty. We can click on create a new API key. As a first step, we give an end to the API key we are creating in the field label. You can choose whatever label you want for the API key. You may want to label it in a way that you know what the API key is used for. In this example, we name it Dr. Fee. Because we're going to use it at Dr. Fee to compare how much fee we would have paid for our trades at different exchanges and identify whether there is saving potential for us. Due to the many different tiers and requirement ex exchanges, it is extremely difficult to compare the fee levels. However, the fee itself differs greatly. Therefore, we want to regularly check whether we are overpaying in fees or not given our trading volume, holdings, and trading style. And we can use this API key in the future again when reassessing our fee saving potential. After typing in the label, we have to complete the two factors authorization by typing in the code and click Create API. As a next step, and this is very important, we have to double check the API restrictions. In our case, we want a read-only access. Hence, we need to make sure only the read-only checkbox is activated. This should be the default setting already. We're going to use the API for Dr. Fee. Therefore, we do not grant any further permissions besides read-only. Through this, Dr. Fee is able to read the historic trades made on the account and can thereby simulate the fee paid at a different exchanges to identify the saving potential. But could of course not access any further data or execute trades or withdraw on the account. Further below, we see that we could specify certain IP address that are allowed to access the API. In this case, we leave it to unrestricted access by checking unrestricted box. Make sure to copy and save the API secret before clicking save. As you cannot access the API secret afterwards anymore, and you will need to create a new API in case the information is lost. We copy the information to the Dr. Fee website to start running the simulation. Now, as a very last step, we click save. Type in the two factors authorization again and finish the process through this. In case you keep the default setting, you do not have to go through the second authorization and can just close the window. All right, if you like the quick walkthrough of how to find your API key and API secret at crypto.com, please leave us a like and a follow to stay up to date with all the new analytics we are developing for traders in the crypto market. There are many powerful analysis coming, so stay tuned. Mm -hmm.